1.7 million students in our country go to a school with no counselor, but those same schools do have cops. There are 14 million students in our country that go to a school that can't afford a nurse, a social worker, or a psychologist, but those same schools can afford a cop. All this, and there is no evidence whatsoever that an increased police presence actually improves school safety. In fact, it does more damage than good, and to who? Historically marginalized students like me. Black and Latino boys with disabilities make up 3% of the entire school population, yet they make up 12% of all school arrests. What's more, school districts like the one I am a part of spend upwards of $50 million each year on cops. This isn't just taxpayer money that's being used to uphold systemic racism, but it's taxpayer money that is being taken away from other valuable resources. Resources like arts education that actually proves to increase student test scores, student grades, attendance, mental health, and it creates the interdisciplinary and innovative thinking that our leaders, that our country needs. Mr. President, end legalized racism. End school police. End the school to prison pipeline.